Hey high school football fans, this is John Schultz reporting for the Holland Sentinel. And tonight we visited Holland Christian, where the Maroons tried to regain some respect a week after being upset at Zeeland East, up against the undefeated Hamilton team. The man with all the records, former quarterback A.J. Westendorp, played catch with Nick Keekover before the game, and maybe passed some of that Maroon magic on, as Keekover threw for five touchdowns in the Maroons' 33-21 win. Well, we, we knew that they were a good defense, and that, that kind of just motivates you more to go out there and do good. And uh, So we, we practiced really, really good this week. We were throwing the ball over the, all over the field, and we just took that into the game. We practiced like we played. I was pretty emotional about our loss. I, I felt like I didn't come out good, and uh, I, I got I lost my temper a little bit in that game. So I, I really did take it upon myself to come out with a good performance and just be a leader of this team. I hit Jordan Mast on a little in route, and then uh, he coughed up the ball. And then Matt was just happened to be right there, picked it up, and picked it up and scored. So. Third and two. Take us through the play. What was going through your mind when you avoided the tackle and just threw up the ball? Well, uh, I, I knew that. Uh, Vuberg had a hitch, so then I, I I got out of the tackle, and then I saw him go, breaking towards the back of the end zone, and then when I threw it, a guy hit me, so then it kind of ducked my throw, and Vuberg just went up and caught. He's been telling me all week he wanted me to throw him a jump ball, so I got him a jump ball. The Maroons intercepted Hamilton quarterback Evan Mudd twice in the fourth quarter, the first by Mitch Vitavine and the second by none other than Keekover himself. Did you enjoy the game? Was that fun? My goodness. Yeah, you know what? That's what we're capable of. That's uh, that's the plan. Our coaches and our kids did a great job. They prepared all, all week long. They had that in mind, and they knew they could do it. So, yeah, that's exciting. That's that's how it's going to finish. The whole year is going to go that way for us. How did you see that it carried over in particular as far as that week of practice? Was it just your focus? or? No, we, we came out. We wanted this one. Zealand East, we're like, mm, you know, we'll roll over them, get some of the other guys some playing time. But we wanted this one from the get-go. So there was, <laughs> there was no doubt in our mind that we couldn't take this one from them. A chance to play for a Oak okay and Green title again. What does that mean, especially after last week's disappointment, to have oh, a chance at a conference title again? Get some of the pride we lost to Zealand East. <laughs> I don't even know how all that fans out where Zealand East sits and everything. But... Um, a win at Byron Center would give us all that pride we lost as the that they did not deserve. This is John Schultz reporting for the Holland Sentinel.